Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with Bitbucket pipelines. Our viewer wants to know how to automatically merge code from the dev branch to the master branch after a successful build. Let's dive into the details. The viewer has a repository with two branches, master and dev. They want to set up a pipeline that merges dev into master whenever code is pushed to dev and the build is successful. However, they are struggling to find information on how to achieve this in Bitbucket pipelines. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get through to that resolution. Let's get started. To automate the merging of your dev branch into the master branch after a successful build, we need to modify your Bitbucket pipeline configuration. First, let's take a look at your existing pipeline configuration. You have a step that runs a deployment check. We'll add the merge commands after this step. Next, we will add the necessary git commands to fetch the master branch, create it if it doesn't exist, and merge the dev branch into it. This configuration ensures that when you push to the dev branch, it will automatically merge into master if the build is successful. Make sure to test this setup to confirm it works as expected. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. You can merge one branch to another in a Bitbucket pipeline using standard Git commands in the script section of your YAML configuration. First, fetch the latest changes, then check out the master branch and merge the dev branch. Finally, push your changes to the remote repository. Make sure to handle errors properly, ensuring that a non-zero exit status is returned if the ant job fails. And that's it guys. I hope we found the solution you're looking for. And look, if we did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.